All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back with Kingdoms and Castles. And before we load it up here, we have a new update. I guess this update came out on the 18th, uh, and I haven't played it since, or the 15th, looks like. Uh, I haven't played it since then, so here are some of the new things that we have. So we can now build wooden walls, stone roads, which like increases the peasant movement by 50%, uh, new statue, which I don't think impress your presence so maybe that has to do with like happiness we also had a happiness bonus to both sta okay yeah there we go uh anoria aqueduct and reservoir you can now irrigate the land soil enrichment and build a an noria near fresh water to pull water up use the aqueducts to transport it to your fields and reservoirs to provide irrigation an irrigated tile allows you to farm it regardless of underlying soil type and provides a bonus crop yield to tiles that are already fertile you can chain nor norias together in the same aqueduct system to put it, push water further across the map. We've also added the concept of salt water versus fresh water. Oh, interesting. And you'll need to place your norias in fresh water. Very cool. Now only buildings with fireplaces can spontaneously catch on fire, which is good. They've tuned food and time. In-game years now take 50% longer, which is good because they were really, really fast. UI updates, uh, please let there be something about the combat. You can now see how much building, uh, uh, no, okay. Uh, it'd be nice if the, the, the military units had an upgrade. Um, and looks like there's just various lots of other, there's just a lot, there's a lot. So anyways, let's just go ahead and load it up here. What are we at? Uh, yeah, so we haven't played since the 9th. 227, 159, 811, 832. So we'll load up this one. Hoboville. Here we go. Is it loading? Here we go. All right. So. Looks like we have a Viking attack. Coming right in at us. Oh, great. This is lovely. Wonderful way to start off. What a wonderful... I was actually reading it. It said fixed bug where Viking attacks happen shortly after... Uh, loading up a save file, so I don't know if that bug was actually fixed or if I'm an asshole, but one way or the other We're gonna try to fight this off. Where are these guys gonna go? Over here by the forest foresters Oh Wow look so these are fire risk. Okay, so let's close these real quick there's about to be a whole lot of craziness going on over there. Okay, looks like we do have... We do have... Some, okay, they're splitting up a little bit. God lord, what is happening? <laughs> we have a little bit of a split here on the ogres. Damn it, these ogres are going to tear everything to crap. I just wanted to check out all the cool new features, but it looks like that's going to be a little bit more difficult, potentially. Come on. Why do they do this? Like, they need to be... You need to be able to select an enemy unit whenever you're trying to defend your base like this. Like, just hands down. That's that's what needs to happen. Kill this ogre. How about that? Hey, there's an ogre dead right there. Already. That's a very good sign. Looks like they're taking a lot of damage from all of our... Various different... Um, archer towers and the ballista towers. Because we did add a lot of those as of recently just fight these guys dude dude bruh they're taking so many shots 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 do we actually fight off all that stuff pretty much we did kill those oh my god these are more lord jeezer get down here this is the biggest viking attack we've ever had to fend off i believe like, this is massive. Holy hell. They're really going to town right now. Alright, guys. Let's go kill all these things, hopefully. Hopefully our towers just chew through these units. I'm not really sure. Like, it looks like they do pretty well against the Vikings themselves. It's just the ogres that give us a lot of trouble. Come on, guys. Kill something. Do something. Do something, brothers. Dun, 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 dun. Eh, he'll die from arrows. 
All right, I think we can pretty much stop worrying about it right now. It looks like the rest of these guys are going to get killed fairly easily from all of our towers. Are these these haven't dropped off yet, have they? This guy's actually returning to his boat. Okay, let's so let's start. What did we have here? Archer tower rubble. So let's go ahead and rebuild that before we forget. Castle, archer tower. Wait, did that say wood castle block? I believe it did. Uh, what was this small stockpile? Move that back. Uh, small stockpile. Boom. What was this? Another small stockpile. Industry, small stockpile. Uh, let's just build it right there. There we go. We can go ahead and open these back up. Booyah, 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 booyah. All right, did we lose? We didn't really lose anything. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. Do we have any damage down here? I don't think so. Oh, wait, what's this? Is it Archer Tower? Yep, Archer Tower. Boom, boom. Give me that. Give me that. Is that it? Oh, here we go. Another Archer Tower, yep. We really didn't lose that much. That was that was pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. What was that? What's happening? Oh, the Viking attack is still happening because of this one ship. What's even on this? Just that one dude? Like, what's he going to do, bro? What's he going to do? You dropping him right there? And he just got killed by the Archer Tower. YOLO, or the Ballista Tower, actually. Oh, this is another thing people have been suggesting me to do. Uh, we need to build a pier. How's the boot right there? Actually, that would have made a lot more sense right here and there. They really blew up my Ballista Tower, them some bitches. Build it out of the way a little bit now, though. Whoops. There we go. Alright. Town. Pier. Pier. What do we what do we need? What? Oh, it goes in the water. I'm dumb. Hopefully that'll work. And then what do we do? Just build. Like, do we just keep doing that through the water or then. I don't know how that works. Also, we can start like replacing all the road. Can I just build over it? You can. That's nice. We're gonna use a lot of stone if we just like replace all the infrastructure through the town with stone road. But that's gonna upgrade our. Uh, it's gonna upgrade our speed so much that I think it would be worth it. I think it would. Oh, we need to open these forest. Wait, I already did that. Okay. But we're getting this stone here. And the stone is just never ending, I believe. But if we're gonna do, if we're gonna start doing that, we should probably start uh, mining some more of it. I think that would be the best bet. It's just to mine the crap out of it. As much as we can, potentially. Let's do that. Got a lot more coming in now. That'll be good. One peasant left the kingdom. That's not good. Happiness is pretty low right now. Let's throw a festival for 35. Over here and over here. Boom. What are we pulling in on taxes right now? Only one. Let's bump that up to two. Wow, they did a lot of work on this. They did. They sure did. They sure enough did. What do you guys got to say? Hmm. Took too long to store a harvest. Shut up. Sire quarries have no place to store their stone. Work is halted. Need more stockpiles. Hmm. Yeah, well. Yeah, well. Maybe since we have so much stone coming in down here, we do a large stockpile. Like right. Right chair. Right chair. There we go. Very good. Look at all this. 
We have 89 idle and no one's built these damn piers yet. I don't get it. Let's do town, stone road, over to the pier. Is that the problem? What? There we go. That'll be good. 39 people visited, but only 29 have found a home. Well, sucks. Sucks for those 10 people, right? That's what I'm saying. All right, let's let's give it a little uh, fast forward action here. Let's see if we can get some of this stuff built up. We have plenty of idle workers. It's just not getting done. Oh, really, dragon? Really, dragon? I ain't even scared, dude. I ain't even scared, dude. So I don't know if once this pier is built, then I can just build regular road between them, or if I have to like just keep building the beer, the pier pieces. I don't know how that works. Where's this damn dragon? He's out here fronting. Out here fronting, bro. Might be a good time to go ahead and continue production of our defenses. Bump, 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 bump. Put a ballista. So we also have wood castle blocks now, which is very interesting. See anything else? Tavern. So apparently these statues like boost morale as well, which is pretty cool. And then we have the reservoir, the aqueducts, and the norias are the really interesting part. Where is this damn dragon? Whatever, dude. Triple time it. Get that dragon here. Is dragon gone? Dragon's gone. Okay, let's take it back, back down to two. All right, so it looks like the piers are done. Can we? No. Okay, so I think we just need to keep doing Pierre Paul. Why does that look so weird? Is that the right? What? What? Like that? Sure. Will that do it? I think so. 37 people visit. Only three found a home. Eight feet. Oh, that's because we're maxed. We're to the max. Do we have room over here for houses? God, we have a quite a kingdom going here. Maybe we build maybe we build some manors down here on this old peninsula. I mean peninsula. Let's see here. Manor. Whoops. Rotate. Maybe. Something like that. Town. Road. We'll just do dirt roads for now, I guess. Oh, snap. We're out of wood. Oh, snickety snap. We're out of... Look at all the people in the water, you silly billies. We reopened these, right? They are reopened. Yes, they are. They are just not bringing in wood fast enough. Unfortunately. Didn't we have some wood production going on down here, too? Yeah, we do. Jeez. Jeezer. That's crazy that we can't keep up with wood production. Maybe we chop some of this and put another one right here. Chop, 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 chop. Chop that wood. Get it out of here. Get it out of here. Let's put another. Let's put it right there, I guess. Hopefully that'll up a little bit of production, but I mean, that's we still only have 40. It's going real slow right now. Of course, we just did all these pier pieces. How much were those? Oh, there's only 15 each. What was taking us so much? I mean, obviously the manners are a lot, but I didn't think they were that much. 50 each? We're just low on wood production right now. And we're running out of land. Running out of land. Wasn't our goal a thousand villagers, though? Peasants? What, what was that noise? Oh. Oh, that's a gawk box notification. All right. Well, that happened. Okay. Let's throw it in a triple time here. I want these damn piers to be done. Get done, son. So now, can we build stone road on top of the piers? Is that how it works? Ah! Yeah. Yeah. 
Very nice. I mean, it's not finished yet. I don't think I had to do that. It looks like they're using it just fine, but it'll look purty, right? It'll look purty. It'll look very pretty. Pretty, pretty. Maybe I should just manually chop a lot of this? I don't know. Will that, will that boost production? Chap, 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 chap. When we have, whoops, canceled that. We have 157 idle villagers. So basically any issue that we have, they should just come over here and, and put some manual labor into the issue. And then everything would be just fine, you know? It's the way I sees it. Chopping all this is really gonna help. Hop three fully. Chop, 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 chop. I think there's a hot key for chop now. Let's see. See? Oh my god. Oh, the hot keys. Thank you, developers. Oh, the hot keys are great. They're wonderful. They're lovely. I love it. It's everything I ever wanted. Plus more. It's so good. It's so good with the hotkeys. Okay, there we go. Wow, we're already up to 400. Yeah, so that manual labor really is helping. Our manor's done. One of them is. The other two nearing completion. None saw fit to stay. Shut up. Shut your whore mouth. Shut. Shut your whore mouth. Okay. All right, are we doing good now? I think we're doing pretty good now. Now what shall we do? Let's hold another festival. Just for giggles and shits. Let's do that. Boom. The rain. The rain never makes people happy, let's be honest. Alright, let's slow this down to double time now. Now what do we want to do? So we got 900 beds. That manor is finishing. We're back up to 500 wood, so... We could actually... Do a couple more manor. That's what I was going to do. Town, manor, one fit right there. That does not look good. Let's uh, chop all this first. Whoops. Is that only two? It's three. It's hard to tell where one chunk of wood starts and one chunk of wood begins. Or ends. I'm high. Alright, let's get that wood out of here. Is that not a separate? Okay, it's not. We need to put a mana there, sir. Rotate. Get that wood out of here. Get it out. Get it out. Get it out. There we go. All right, now I need to remember to keep putting up wells as we... That's not a well. These wells... Make sure that our stuff doesn't all burn down. All right. Unusable stone. Unusable it is. Let's put up some beachfront property right here. Just like that. I would love to live there. Look at that. It looks so fancy. So fancy schmancy. This music is just wonderful. I love it. That might look a little cramped to you. And, and that's because it is. But that's really going to upgrade our, uh, our peasant. Our peasant level. And I'm excited about that. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. All right, let's slow it down. Double time. Okay, so I say, I say we start replacing all the road in the kingdom with stone. Let's just see how how fast we burn through it, though. Wait, which what's? Oh, it costs gold too. I didn't even notice that. Peasants are not going to be happy with the taxes for the next couple years. But, I mean, I mean, we're getting them stone roads. It's going to be, like, better for their feet and stuff, right? Totally. Totes my goats. All right, let's actually... We should have, like, started over here where most of our, like, industry and stuff is, probably. Maybe? I don't know. The slow process of replacing all the roads with stone arena I just need to watch the gold which we're actually doing alright on so far get out of here 
Come on. Come in. Come on. Look at these beautiful stone roads. Da dun dun. Da ding ding. Da dun dun. Da dun dun. Let's just go ahead and triple time it, I guess. This top down angle, it might not be the most pleasing thing to look at, but it really helps me click all these roads a little bit more efficiently. Look how fast these stone roads are getting built now. That's what I'm talking about. Still got 800 gold and 1400 stone, so that's not too bad. Currently keeping up with the demand. Because we are using a lot. A lot, a lot. Get out of here. A lot, a lot. Alright, keep on going around the bend. Boom, 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 boom. Whoops, what's... Okay, yeah, we're good there. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Alright, let's go this way now. Hula has died of old age. That's unfortunate. That's a sweet name, though. Hula? I wonder if her last name was Hoop. God, I'm funny. Sorry for that. That was a dad joke. I'm so sorry. 1,400 stones, 778. We're keeping up with the gold just barely. This is a whole lot of road to replace. But you know what? A necessary upgrade, I feel like. The citizens of Hoboville, they sure deserve it. They put in a lot of hard work. And a lot of their relatives have died of famines and dragon attacks and viking attacks and you know things have been pretty life around Hoboville has been pretty easy as of lately but it wasn't always the case you know and people need to need to know that they're appreciated and that their relatives died for stone stone roads you know that's what's important is that people know what their relatives died for and they're here to reap the benefits of these stone roads. I don't know what I'm talking about. We don't need that there. I think that was an accidental. Yeah, that was a misclick. A first year. Okay, pop that there, there, there. We've actually almost got it all already. 1,200, 1,300 left, 750. All right, did we get everything on this? Just this little strip here? Why is there even road there? Oh well. Whoa! We got that all done. Our production time and everything though is going to be so much faster once all these roads are replaced. So it's like an aesthetic, but it's also practical, which is cool. It's pretty cool beans. Stop it. Get there, get there. Doink, 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 doink. Not much left. Doink, 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 doink. Boom! I believe that is all the road in the kingdom. Which is pretty awesome. We are now fully upgraded. The roads are looking legit. We're at 973 villagers. I'm going to go ahead and lower taxes now. So we paid off our roads. And we still have 750 coin. Happiness was a little bit low, so it's going up a little bit now. Let's go ahead and throw a couple festivals. That should help a little bit with the happiness as well, because we have 1,032 beds available, 967 population. So we get that happiness up a little bit. See, there we go. We got 39 people visited, 31 stayed. We're at 996. We're about to break that one thousand mark, which was our goal, I believe. Humble Kingdom, there we go. Congratulations. Hoboville is now a humble kingdom. Kingdom of a thousand people strong. How lucky the people are to have you as their king. God, that just gives me a big head reading that, you know? That makes me feel really good. Like, I'm an awesome king. I First of all, I'm a king. Let's just all, let's just think about that for a second, okay? Let's let that soak in, that I am a king, okay? A fucking king. All right, I'm going to put up, before my head gets too big, I'm going to put up some more castle walls uh, with some ballistas and archer towers. Put 
one over here. Put one like right here. Can never have too many of these. That's what I've learned. Bump. Oh, yep. See, here comes a dragon. Sons of bitchin' dragons. Okay, let's get. Whoops, no, we have that. So let's put. Doink. Wait, did the dragon just say screw it? I'm done. Did he just leave? I think he just left, dude. You don't want to mess with us. All right, ballista. Boom. 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 Wait, did I forget to put something on top of that? Nope, archer, okay. There we go. All right. Well, we have really just upgraded things a lot here. Look at that. We've got all these new manors down here. We've got the archer and ballista towers going up to defend this, this new area. We had to upgrade our uh, wood production a little bit there because things got a little crazy. Even a little bit of stone because we did a whole lot of stone upgrades with the road system. We connected the two uh, land masses with the pier and the road across, which is really seeming to help a little bit. Which is very good. And all our speed on our on our, uh, on our our Deuterinos is upgraded anyways. The peasants. Because of the stone walkways. So that's awesome. But yeah, I think this is a good stopping point. Actually, I don't really know. Do you guys want to see a new kingdom? I mean, we hit our goal of a thousand peasants. Um, I think, I mean, we've pretty much knocked this one out of the park. Do you guys want to see a new kingdom? Or, or what do you guys want to... Apparently there's a new update that they're working on. They're adding like new merchants and stuff like that. Um, so, you know, we'll have some new stuff to do then, but as of right now, I mean, I think we've pretty much done everything that we could do on this playthrough. I mean, I could put some statues up or something, maybe, you know, but we've done about everything we could do. Look, we are, look, we're killing dragons, like, that dragon landed on the farm and destroyed it. That's some bitch. That's some bitch. I ain't even replanting it. I don't give a fuck. But yeah, we hit our short-term goal. Like I said, oh, look, we can zoom out and see the whole... That is just beautiful. There's just so much going on right there. So let me know what you guys want to do. You know, what you want to do. If you want to see more kingdoms and castles, let me know what you exactly want to see. All that good stuff. We could issue challenges. You know, like maybe I'll start a new one and see if we can get to a 2,000 peasants or something like that. Maybe... I don't know. I don't know. We'll just have to see what we can do. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you on the next video. Yeah!